On this episode of Relationship 911, Cassie is asking the question, is it okay for my boyfriend to have a best friend that was his ex-girlfriend? Oh, that's a tricky one. This is a tricky one. It's so tricky. <laughs> this is a tricky one, and I'll tell you why. Because there were feelings shared, and often in relationships, people, if there's gonna be something that's gonna make someone jealous and feel insecure, it's the possibility of their partner having an emotional relationship with someone else. Especially if they were previously romantically involved. Now, here's my answer. Is it possible? Yes. If you are super evolved and super confident. And a really good communicator and very open, authentic, and have great agreements. And just know that it is potentially a Pandora's box because what, like, just like what we were saying, if in relationships, the reason why people have friends and the reason why people have often best friends is because they need someone that they can share with, they can share experiences with, they can have conversations with. And often if you're in a relationship and there are things that you need to work through, well, who do you talk to? You talk to your friends about it. Well, how's it gonna go when you're talking to your ex- Partner. Partner it potentially could be really, really sticky. So the key is to know what you're getting into in advance. And to also know the nature of your relationship. If this is your soulmate, if this is your person, if this is a, something that you feel like we can manage this and handle it, then maybe you need checkpoints, you need milestones, you need parameters around it that help you know, yes, I still feel comfortable. Yes, I still feel comfortable, but you have an agreement. If at any point something doesn't feel comfortable anymore, you'll bring it forward. You know, what's so funny is we were just talking about When Harry Met Sally, which is one of my favorite movies. And the whole premise of the movie is that men and women can't be friends, that they actually deep down want to have a physical relationship. And we don't have an answer. This is an age old question, but our answer is it is possible if you choose it and you communicate really well about it and that you go into it with eyes wide open, knowing that there are going to be things that you can't provide to your boyfriend that he's gonna seek from other people and that one of those other people may be his ex-girlfriend and you have to be okay with that. And there are things, we, we talk about this all the time, that I can't provide for Monica. There is times when she needs girl time and that she goes out and she's with friends because it's not something that I'm providing for her. That's right. And you know, if we really want to get edgy on this one, there's even relationships where people have open relationships and it totally works. It's not what Jan and I have, but I don't, I'm not against it. I actually really understand the idea about it. And I think that it's, it just takes some real honesty and it's challenging. It's confronting. It's not the norm, but just because something's not the norm doesn't mean it can't happen. We can handle that conversation in a totally different relationship. <laughs> 9 -1 -1. Speaking of Pandora's box, you just open one there. So in conclusion, relationships work because people choose to make their relationships work. And people have all sorts of different agreements, just like what Monica was saying. So it's really up to you. If this is really important to your boyfriend and you really want to make the relationship work with him, then it's really about listening to your heart, having a clear communication and making compromises, making agreements and doing what works for both of you so that you both can win in the situation. So if this is a topic that is near and dear to your heart, if you've been in a relationship and your partner has had a best friend that was a significant other, we really wanna hear about it. Our audience wants to know. This is a question we get a lot. So please comment below. Yeah, and for more support with your relationship, click the subscribe button for more Relationship 911.